Alright, we're back. Whew, I think I've spoken to everyone. I should go talk to Captain Tyler. Alright, so, this is gonna be very interesting. And Captain Tyler's got some interesting armor on, I just noticed. Hi, Captain Tyler. Hello, Kevin Fick 33, making progress with your investigation. I've spoken to everyone, I think. Well done, that was quite a task. Why don't you tell me what you found out and we can decide if any of it is worth following up? You summarize everything you've heard from people you've spoken to. Very thoroughly done. I think you may be onto something, but I don't want to interfere. You should think about everything you've heard of and see if anyone stands out as a likely candidate. It would be someone who has access to pests and has a motive for wanting to release one. If you think you're the candidate, confront that person and see what they say. They may confirm your suspicions. Then I'll think we'll be able to do a report back to Commodore Matthias. Okay, so. We've got Amy and Diana. They're both knights. But basically, anyone who's a knight has access to the pests. But Amy and Diana seem to. Diana seems to talk a lot about money, according to Amy, and Amy seems to be acting really suspiciously, according to. According to Diana. They seem to be going at each other about it. And Knight Bernard is, just seems to be a pretty nice guy. He doesn't seem to be very suspicious. Squire Sam is a squire. He does not have access to pests. Knight McCall wants a promotion. There's no reason why he'd want to have a pest release. Hmm. It seems like anyone's very lucky except for maybe Diana or Amy. Amy seems to be acting very weirdly though. Blah blah blah. No, no, it's very suspicious. I said the hands and blah blah blah. Okay, let's see here. How about? You know what? Let's confront her about this. I believe you've done something wrong. You stole money from Diana. I'm like, oh, she won't tell her, will you? Holy crap, that's scary. <laughs> I'm like, oh, she won't tell her, will you? I'm going to move back. I just got tired of her lording it over me. Okay. Well. <laughs> okay, then. <laughs> I don't know, this is. So, basically, we know that. Basically, we know that for for what it's worth, that Amy stole Diana's money. Okay. Is there. Yeah. That doesn't really sound like it's very useful to me. Right, Paul. Jessica. Does Jessica have access to pests? She claims to be spending a lot in her basement on the field. I'm probably being really stupid about this right now, but let's just keep going because that's all the purpose of doing this anyway. Okay, who should we check out next? Night Diana. Hi, I'd like to ask you a few questions. Investigate blah blah blah. Not me, no, not me. I guess my sister saying me. Blah blah blah. Blah blah blah. Have you done something wrong? I can tell that she stole money from herself. Yeah, but no. Okay, so basically it's either Terry, Mariah, or um, Mc Michael that broke Mrs. Scord's face and lets Mrs. Scord herself. But it's on a rickety table. I think it's Terry that broke his face because he doesn't even. I'm, the only person that's been around the house has been Mariah. Oh, Thomas, my own. Charles, with all my friends. Excuse Maria, blah blah blah. Steeds. I believe you've done something wrong. Okay, you've been cheating with Michael's girlfriend. <laughs> you've been cheating with Michael's girlfriend. Huh? Mariah? Heck no, I would never want to date Mariah. She's just snob. I only let her visit because Michael's my best friend. He's been really busy and I thought she wanted to keep, me out of his, keep her out of his hair for a while. Oh, well. Huh, okay. So, let's see, he broke Mrs. Gord's vase. You did something wrong. You broke your mother's vase. No, I did not! I think we both know that you did. You got angry with her and broke the vase in revenge. It was an accident. I just walked by and the thing fell off the table. Okay, so we know that she broke the vase. But, what's the significance because of that? None. Blah blah blah. Brown seeds. I believe you've done something wrong. Just for the heck of it, I'll say. You've been cheating on your boyfriend. No, I am not. I swear I'm not. But there's no one else in the world I love more. 
But he's been ignoring me and I don't know what else to do. And so I hang out with other people and then rumors start. It's so unfair. Maybe you should explain that to all before the rumors get out of control. Okay, so. Now that explains it. Met with him. Blah, blah. Blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. blah, blah. Okay, so this is it. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so. Okay, photo up Miss Deeds. I believe you've done something wrong. She's, he's not playing the digits girlfriend if he wants to marry her. I'll s you're risking his whole career if you did that. That's good. Okay, and Tybo. Tybo's for the win. Jessica doesn't seem to have Actually, she could have access to you. Suspicious thing. Has escaped. Wow. Um, no. No, it's not a strange thing. Sam guys, what do you mean? Take him to my cake. I wouldn't say suspicious thing. So, what's with the whole. Here. Confront about a crime. I believe you done something wrong, Jessica. You let him hit. Has escaped to the mainland. No! No, I didn't! You have no proof! An escape is a, is a subjective term. I mean, what if it was more like freeing? I think we'll my final is Captain Ty and see what he thinks. Looks like Jessica is the one here. I confronted Jessica about releasing a pest, but her eye was weak and I think she may know something new if she didn't do it, do it herself. Hmm, interesting. That was the conclusion I came to as well. The reaction does seem telling. You must report this to the Commodore. He will want to investigate this further himself. Okay, so we seem to get things and oh, let's take a look here. And hopefully, whatever spine is going to be asking me, let's see what he asks. As long as it doesn't involve spoiling the nerves. Commodore Matthias. Commodore, I think you've made. I think I've made a breakthrough. Captain Ty agrees. I've questioned everyone. The only person who has access to the pest and may also have my motive for releasing one is Jessica, the researcher. That's almost criminal. I can't believe it. Still, a Ty thinks so too. I guess I'd better speak with him. Alright, so. Jessica, please cooperate. I give you permission to raise your share on the understanding that you would obey all of our rules. If a pest is loose on the mainland, we need all the information we can get. I am not accusing you of releasing a pest, I simply need to follow up on any leads. Kirby 33 feels you might know something. But I don't, I already told you. You've been very kind to me and I would never do anything to endanger anyone. Yes, but you don't consider pests to be as big as the threat as the rest of us. You might feel letting a pest go free is harmless. That's enough, I'm afraid. I'm afraid, Jessica, we must take more drastic measures to find the truth and be certain you have nothing to hide. The Void Knights have developed a potion that will let the drink enter the mind of another person. That's invasive! I don't want you to enter someone in my head. I've told you everything! I'm sorry, Jessica. The dangerous pests in the mainland calls for extraordinary measures. I insist that you do this, and as all of your research will be confiscated and you end, and any other mages from the Wizard's Tower will be banned from these islands. Will you consent? My research is important. I don't want to lose it. I'll consent. Very good. To retain violence, I want someone unrelated to the voidness to enter your mind so that we unbiased your thoughts about pests. Very good, Are you willing to enter Jessica's mind and find out the truth? Yes. I'll do it. That is very good, Cover for Very I'm sure this will all turn out well. Jessica has a good heart. And I'm sure this is all a simple misunderstanding. What do I need to do? Drink the potion and focus on the memories you want to access. On, on entering Jessica's mind, you will see those, those memories and be able to determine if she did release a piss on the plane to the mainland or not. Karasi, please give some of the potion to Kyrie for 53. We shall begin it immediately. Okay, so... That's a memoir, but she's really trying hard to obscure it. I'll have to unscramble to find out what the memory means. Okay, it looks like we got a puzzle here. I'm not gonna risk breaking rules to do a request on someone else's account. Signs of let's quests are meant to be done blind. Memories. 
so that also answers your question. If anyone is ever wondering why I haven't been um, doing Let's Quest of other quests, that's why. That's why. Okay, so this is basically a slider puzzle. Hopefully it's not as bad as the one in Elemental Workshop Part 3. Alright. Only thing is, I'm starting to run out of time here, so... It looks like I need to get a certain piece to the center. Come on. <sighs> Alright, anyway, I'll have to start. I'm gonna start a new video after I take a 